problem with an audience is, is not so much in this country, is it, or in, the, in, in Europe. It's, in a, it's strange in America. I mean, yes, it's very, very a strange phenomenon. In Europe, uh, I'm idolized. I, I walk down the street and they, they shake my hand and throw flowers and kiss me. <laughs> in the United States, I'm a bum. <laughs> they, you know, for some reason, they, I have a very small audience in the United States, very loyal, but small. And no matter what I do, no matter who's in my movies, uh, whether it's me as the star of the movie or Leonardo DiCaprio, the same group of cult fans comes, and the majority of people do not. And that's, and, but when I open my films in Europe, everybody comes, and, and it, it gives the illusion of, you know, of great success. Does that bother you that you're not the, the profit in your, or you are the profit in your own country, that honor, so to speak? It, um, <coughs> my cough. It, it will return from time to time at judicious moments when I have to stall and think. <laughs> it, uh, it's not that it, it, it bothers me, but it mystifies me. That investigation and the attendant publicity that convinced the reclusive Allen to sit down with us in his Manhattan apartment and discuss the situation no holds barred. The allegations are that you took Dylan into a attic or crawl space, mm -hmm. that uh, you touched her in her private part. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Is there any truth to that at all? Look, be, be logical about this. Is there any truth to that at all? Um, <coughs> my cough. It, look, be, be logical about this. Um, <coughs> my cough. It, it will return from time to time at judicious moments when I have to stall and think. <laughs> <laughs> it, uh, it's not that it, 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 it bothers me, but it mystifies me. That uh, you touched her in her private part. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Is there any truth to that at all? Look, be, be logical about this. I'm, I'm 57. Isn't it illogical that I'm going to, at the height of a, a very bitter, acrimonious custody fight, drive up to Connecticut where... Nobody likes me in the house. I'm, I'm with a house full of enemies. I mean, Mia was so enraged at me, and, and she had gotten all the kids to, to be angry at me, that I'm going to drive up there and suddenly, on visitation, pick this moment in my life to become a child molester. It's just, it's just incredible. I could, if I wanted to be a child molester, I had many opportunities in the past. I could have quietly made a, a, a custody settlement with Mia in some way and done it in the future. I mean, you know, it's so insane. Alan is cooperating with the investigation. He's made his own psychiatric files and the files of his children available to authorities. He's submitted to a polygraph and a battery of psychological tests. The reports we were shown would seem to support his contention he's not a child molester.